Now that's a regulator. Hi guys, Alec Pierce, Scuba Tech Tips. When I say that's a regulator, I mean it. Now you probably out there saying, ah, oh, you're gonna talk about those old two hose regulators again. This is not an old two hose regulator. This is a new two hose regulator. Not rebuilt, not upgraded. This is brand spanking new. 21st or 22nd century, where are we? The 21st, 2018. That's right, modern components, modern engineering, everything, per and just breathe. In just a minute, you're gonna see me in the pool with this thing, watch my eyes. When you see me, this is an absolutely, this is not for display, this is for using. In fact, we're gonna show you some pictures of divers, pictures and videos of divers using this Kraken regular, Kraken double hose regulator all over the world, under the ice, in just a moment, we're going to go and I'm going to jump in the pool with this beautiful brand spanking new Kraken regulator and check it out. See how it works. One of the things I want to show you for sure is, first of all, these hose weights. Sometimes these double hose hoses, they curl up around your head, but you can get hose weights. You can see them there. There's a couple of hose weights. There's a little lead rings or heavy rings that go around the hoses to help keep it down. You'll be able to see that. But most important is this special mouthpiece. Ah, you got to watch it because you see... When you have a double hose regulator, and the first stage is back there, when you go like this, just two inches of water just goes down two inches and it free flows. <laughs> so, with the Kraken, what they have is a fantastic, you just turn the mouthpiece, and it doesn't do that. Boy, this breathes beautifully. The pool is nice and clean too. Now if I take the rig out of my mouth, no bubbles. That's because the mouthpiece is lower than the valve. Clears easily. Boy, that was easy to clear. Love this mouthpiece. If I take it out and raise it above the valve, three flows. Just like a double hose should. And I can use that to clear. That clears well too. Watch this. Bubbles. Turn off the mouthpiece. No bubbles. That cut off mouthpiece works beautifully. Look at that. Let's see what happens when I look up. No change. It breathes easily. Up or down? Oh, I know what to do. If I lay right down on the bottom, it'll be hard to breathe. Land it on the gauges. It still breathes easily. What kind of a double hose is this? Ah, let's blow on my back. I know what'll happen now. It'll free flow like mad. Nope. No bubbles. I've used lots of two hose regulars and you can't lay on your back to breathe from them normally. I love this Kraken. Let's go up and talk about it. I think I want to get one of these. Is that ever great? <laughs> Upside down, right side up, beautiful. What's it got? Okay, well, first of all, this is all modern materials, so there's no corrosion. It's a cycle lac case. Cycle lac is like the stuff your steering wheel is made of. You can't break a steering wheel, you know that, right? Unbreakable, corrosion proof. This will never, you still need to maintain it. You still need to rinse and clean. Don't, don't get, get away from all, all my tips that I've given you over the years. Rinsing and cleaning is very important, but if, if you don't get it cleaned right away, this is, it won't corrode. Everything is heavy, heavy duty. Look at the plating on this, the heavy screw. It's just a beautifully built regulator. Uh, it's solid, easy to maintain. It comes, not like the old ones. Boy, the old ones you had to have about three tools and two guys to help you take the body apart. This has got beautiful stainless steel screws and nuts. Comes apart easily for cleaning if you want to do it yourself. The hoses, these hoses are great. They're still very, very flexible. 
right? But these new materials, I don't even know what this material is for sure. I read about it, and you can read about the, the technical information. I'm telling you about the, the neat stuff. I'm telling you about the stuff that gets you, you know? Uh, technically, these, these have a name, but these are fantastic. They're a stretch of the air, and yet they're solid, too. They're not limp. They're not thin and small. Lightweight, you know? As, a, as regulators go, goes on the tank, it's very lightweight. The mouthpiece is fantastic. I love this mouthpiece. First of all, <clears throat> you can fit any personal mouthpiece, this, this part here that goes in your mouth, anything you want. If you've got one of those personalized, you know, the ones you can bite on and make them shape to your teeth, secure, whatever they're called, you can put that on here. So you can have your own mouthpiece on this T piece here, called a mouthpiece as well. This is the very latest, very large exhaust, non-returned valves in here. Easy to clean, easy to maintain, easy breathing. So it just has everything going for it you can possibly think of. It's missing a few things. Missing a couple of things. No purge button. You see? There's no purge button on this. A couple of things about that. First of all, you really don't need to purge it very much. The only water you might get in if the mouthpiece came out is a bit of water here in the mouthpiece. And again, if you watch my vintage uh, uh, double hose uh, uh, videos at all, you know that you can purge these or clear the water up pretty easily. There's a couple ways to do that up over your head or a big breath blow, just like a regular, regular. So the, the lack of a purse button is not really a deficit, not really a lack. Now, when you're wearing these, you have to be a little, it's a little bit different. These regulators, you want it to be low on your back, down nice and low. Shoulder blades, because it's right across from your chest. So you want the regulator body to be the same level as your chest. So you don't want it up high behind your head. That's actually good. You won't be bumping your head on it. So that's important. And these don't have any kind of a manual venturi adjustable second stage breathing or any of that stuff. It really doesn't need it. It really doesn't need it. It has a Venturi effect. It has incredibly easy breathing all the time. It doesn't free flow, particularly with this, uh, this mouthpiece, shut off mouthpiece. It's really, really fantastic. You can add all the accessories that you currently have on your modern regulator. That's right. The old regulators didn't have a pressure gauge. It wasn't good. We managed, we managed. It wasn't good. Pressure gauge right in there right down on your side there it is your computer transmitter whatever you have to monitor your air supply you can put it on the kraken safe second what we call an octopus or safe second so there's no more buddy breathing you give your buddy your safe second that's right clips right in there hanging on your right hand side so you can use this perfectly safely you have a safe second what about your buoyancy compensator you know your power inflator can't live without that anymore we didn't even have BCs in the old days, but now today, for diving, you have to have a buoyancy compensator, and the power inflate makes buoyancy compensation very, very easy. It actually makes it safer than diving without it. No problem. Plug it right into there. So all of those different ports on the back will accommodate all the accessories. You can even get a dry suit hose on here if you needed to, and you can use this anytime. These are, these are by design environmentally sealed. You don't have to have any special rubber cap on it or any silicone oil or anything. By design, a two-hose regulator with the first and second stage encased inside this psycholac body, by design it is environmentally protected. That's right. Very, very unlikely to freeze, even in the coldest water. So it has a lot of uh, special features, uh, aside from the fact that it's 2018 designed uh, materials used, superb materials, the very finest materials. And I know the, the, the distributor, the manufacturer distributor of this regulator, and great guy, but he's very, very fussy. Every regulator that comes out of the vintage double hose factory before it goes to a diver has been tested a lot. He has a special machine that he puts these regulators on that actually breathe it. He can have a breathe five times or 5,000 times to make sure it's working perfectly. So it's absolutely perfect. Parts, service, and it looks cool. It really looks cool. If you watched Sea Hunt, or if you watched any of those old movies, and you know the early divers, this is what they used to wear. Well, now you can actually have a double hose regulator. It looks like it's 50 years old, made last week. It's fantastic. Why would you want one of these? Well, that's the reason. Maybe you not use a double hose regulator and would like to give it a try, there's your chance. Or maybe you are a double hose diver and miss them from the old days. Well, <clears throat> don't get an old one.
you won't miss it for long. Get one of these. In fact, Kevin's got some fantastic pictures from too many. Yeah, you want to be crazy. Fantastic pictures of divers using the vintage double hose Kraken regulator. And we're going to show you some of those right now. And here you go, modern, easy breathing, high technology, all the ports ready to go. So there's several reasons why you might want to try one of these. Okay, I thought you might enjoy that. The pictures and some information about the Kraken and my experience, my impressions of it. I think it's great. Okay, that's it. Gotta go. Alec Pierce, Scuba Tech Tips. I'll talk to you again soon.